Hi there, I'm sure that you've already subscribed to our channel Life with Catman, but if you haven't, you have the time to do that now. And today I want to talk to you about uh, black cats. Uh, there are many people in the world that have black cats, but a lot of people think that they bring bad luck and some people think that they bring good luck. So let's talk about that. Do black cats bring good luck or bad luck? Black cats are amazing creatures that are just as sweet and cuddly as any other cat. Unfortunately, many people around the globe believe that black cats bring bad luck, especially when they cross your path. In ancient Egypt, things were still looking up for black cats. They were worshipped just like their more colorful bodies. Uh, the ancient Egyptian god of cats called Bastet was often portrayed as a woman with the head of a black cat, so our black felons had nothing to fear. However, in the Middle Ages in Europe, black cats were often associated with witches. According to a legend, father and son were traveling together on a moonless night when a black cat crossed their path. They threw stones at the cat until the poor, injured animal found its way into the nearby home of a woman suspected of being a witch. The next day, the father and son saw the woman bruised and limping, which led them to begin telling everyone that the woman, and thus all other witches, could turn into black cats at night to prowl the streets unnoticed. This belief was eventually echoed in America during the time of the Salem Witch Trails, of course, the association between black cats and evil or bad luck is nothing more than a superstition. Still, it remains a belief held by many people. In fact, the next time Halloween rolls around, take notice of how many black cats you see on Halloween decorations. But it's not all bad news for black cats. There are some places in the world where black cats are honored. For example, many people in Scotland, Great Britain, Japan and Russia view black cats as signs of good luck and prosperity. For those of you who believe that black cats bring, bring good luck, but for all of you that don't as well, here are some facts uh, that show that black cats actually bring good luck. First, black cats bless marriages. English superstition says that giving a bride a black cat on her wedding day will bring her good luck in her marriage. It's also thought that newlyweds with a black cat in their home will have a long, happy life together, and the black cat will ward off evil spirits. In much of the UK, the black of a cat is a lucky color. Next, black cats possess a strong pow powers of good. If you keep your black cats happy and safe, they will keep you happy and safe. If you don't have a black cat in real life to guard your home, a black cat figurine facing north will keep bad energy and spirits away. It's also been long believed that black cats invite not only fortune in the way of good luck, but also in the way of wealth. French peasants long believed that if a black cat was released at a crossroads where five roads intersect, the black cat would lead them to treasure. In Norse mythology, the goddess of love, fertility and beauty, Freya, rides on a chariot pulled by two black cats. To win favor with Freya, farmers would leave bowls of milk for her companions in their fields. Freya would then bless them with a good harvest. And in the south of France, black cats have been called matagot and are known as magician cats or even money cats. If shown the proper respect, like being given the first bite of dinner, having a nice bed to sleep in, or having a home even after their owner's death, the Matagot will, will reward their person with wealth and good luck. This belief does have some ties to black cats and negative connotations of witchcraft, but I choose to look at it as those who do not treat their cats well get their comeuppance. Black cat or not, I'm sure most of our family members would agree that having the first bite of our dinners is well within their rights. <laughs>